Why is this apple brown? Welcome to Ryan Toy Reveal. Hi, Ryan. What's up, Combo? I brought you some fruit for snack time. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks, Combo. This looks really yummy. Why is this apple brown? Oh no! That's not what it looked like earlier! Sorry, Ryan! It's okay, Combo, but I wonder what's the best way to keep fruits like apples from turning brown. Okay, Ryan! What ideas do you have? Maybe putting fruits in different places will keep it from turning brown. Awesome! I think... Uh... Oh, that putting fruit in a liquid will keep it from turning brown. Okay, Combo, let's do some tests. First, you need an apple and ask a grown up for help to cut it up. Okay, so I asked Daddy to cut the apple in five slices. Five different apple slices, five different places. I'm gonna put this one in the fridge. We're going to see if the cold will help it from turning brown. Second apple is going outside into the sun. We're going to see if the heat will help it from turning brown. Next, I'm going to wrap this apple slice to see if it helps it from turning brown. Next, I'm going to put this apple slice in the drawer to see if the darkness makes any difference. I'm going to put this apple slice right here out in the open to see how regular apple turns brown. Out of all the places I put the apples, I think the one I put in the fridge is going to be the least brown. I hope I'm right. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Hey, everyone. I'm here doing an experiment with liquids to see if they keep apples from turning brown. And this is my assistant, Bree. Hey, guys. Remember to always ask for an adult's help if you're doing this experiment. All right, let's get started, though. Bree, can you chop up that apple? Of course. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Good chopping skills, Bree. Thank you so much. I've been practicing my chop just for this. I can tell. Before we do anything else, safety first. So, Bree, put on your safety glasses. One day later. Okay, Combo, it's been the next day. Let's compare our results. You got it, Ryan. What are your results? So, this one I left on the counter, and this one I put in the dark. They look almost the same, so the darkness doesn't affect it at all. And this is the one I left in the sun, and it's super dried up. And it's also a little bit brown. 
and this is the little one I put in the wrapper. See? Look, it's not even a little bit brown. But the best one is the one that I put in the fridge. It's barely brown. Based on the experiment I did, when apples touch air, it turns brown. So the one that I put in the wrap, it doesn't look brown because it was wrapped. And the one I put in the fridge, it wasn't brown because it was cold, not dry. Combo, what was your results? Again, safety first. So Bree's putting on gloves because these apples might be gross. Okay, I've been waiting all night. Are you ready to see the results, Bree? I've been waiting all night. Let's do this. Okay, so let's check out the control apple first. Ah, oh, that one's really brown. Oh, and it's all dried up. Yeah. Now let's check out the vegetable oil one. Oh, Ooh. it's a little slimy. But, you know, this one was my guess, and it looks pretty good. Next up, it's yogurt. It's a little stuck. There we go. Ugh, look at that. It's looking pretty brown. I don't know, yogurt. Let's check out the next one. Now we got my pick, the Ooh. chocolate. Oh, ah, oh, chocolate syrup. That is definitely brown. Chocolate syrup is tasty, but it's not good at keeping apples from turning brown. Let's go on to the next one. Lemon juice. This one looks really good. I don't see any brown. You're right. That one does look really good. We might have a winner here. Ooh, but let's keep going. Let's check out the maple syrup one now. Uh, okay, this one is not looking that good. Very dry. Now let's look at the orange juice. Ooh, now this one has quite a bit of mold growing on it. Ew. Okay. Let's use freshly squeezed orange juice next time. <laughs> this one has some mold on it too, but not as bad as the orange juice. Oh no! It's like what happened to the orange juice. Wow, that was really fun. Even if it was a little gross at times. But which liquid do you think did the best? I think definitely the lemon juice because there was no brown on that apple at all. I agree, my assistant. You guys at home can also try this too. There's so many other liquids and places you can experiment with. And other fruits you can try too. But be sure to ask your parents to help you out. Good finding, Combo. Yay, we did it. We learned how to keep an apple from turning brown. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Please click on one of these videos for Ryan Toy Review more fun.